20 years ago, almost to the day, Doug and I were uh, in a conference room in uh, Doug Lavalette's, one of, my, one of Doug Lavalette's uh, massive businesses, planning this business. And Doug's job was to uh, get the math right, make sure all the projections were solid, and my job was to bring clients. So we uh, ended up launching the company, and uh, the only problem we had was Doug's numbers were right on if we would have had clients. We had nothing. <laughs> Fortunately, that condition has changed. So thank you. There was there's really two things that we stuck to as well that I, I think today is probably the best evidence of that, and that is first thing we did is we said, we're going to try to work with partner contractors, vendors, suppliers, and we're going to treat them like we love them. We're going to treat them like we respect them, and we think that uh, we'll get that back in spades. And um, it's, it, seems really, it seems really simple and it seems really obvious, but uh, from our standpoint, there's never been a successful building built that doesn't have a, has that whole team thinking the same way. And that's, uh, that's absolutely, um, absolutely critical. The other one is um, the clients that we've, the clients that we've been able to work with. One of the things that we said in the beginning was, there's really one question we should ask every client that's working on a project, and we, you know, you you ask a client and you get into the details of what they're trying to do, and usually it's obviously related to some business initiative or another, and they'll tell us and we'll talk about what they want to do, but we from day one basically said, we, we can understand what they want to do, but we need to know why they want to do it. So another simple question, but that led to being able to understand what they were doing. What we didn't expect, and to this day I find just incredibly rewarding, is what we learned along the way. What we learned from our contractor partners, what we've learned from our clients is just unbelievable because we're right in the eye of the storm with them. There are usually huge sums of money at stake, and uh, you see the kind of pressure they're under in terms of making their businesses successful. You just end up feeling damn responsible to help them as well. So we appreciate, uh, appreciate all you guys for being here. Everybody, everybody here has been party to building this company, and there's no way we'd be here without you. One of these guys that is responsible for us still being here is my banker. 